Hello, welcome back to this video series on area of a triangle. In this video, we shall look at the different bases and heights of a triangle. Previously, on area of a triangle, we had a triangle ABC as shown. We then drew its related rectangle ABDE. AB is the base of triangle ABC and it is the common side shared by the triangle and its related rectangle. CF is the height of triangle ABC. It starts from C, which is the vertex away from the base, and goes all the way down to the base. It is perpendicular to the base. It is also the other side of the related rectangle. We can find the area of the triangle using half times base times height. Let's say the base AB is 3 cm long and the height CF is 4 cm. Then, the area of triangle ABC is equal to half times 3 cm times 4 cm, which is equal to 6 square centimeters. Notice that the base is one side of the triangle. What happens to the height if we choose another side of the triangle as the base? Let's find out. We have our triangle ABC from just now. Let's make two copies of triangle ABC. Let's choose another side of the triangle as the base. As a triangle has three sides, there are three possible choices for the base. We have already seen the first case. Let's look at the second case. Here, AC is the base. We can draw the related rectangle from the base like this. The base AC is the common side shared by the triangle and the related rectangle. In this case, the height is GA. It is perpendicular to the base. We can move the height so that it starts from B, which is the vertex away from the base AC, and goes all the way down to the base. So BI is also the height of triangle ABC. Let's look at the third case. Here, BC is the base. We can draw the related rectangle from the base like this. The base BC is the common side shared by the triangle and the related rectangle. In this case, the height is JB. It is perpendicular to the base. We can move the height so that it starts from A, which is the vertex away from the base BC, and goes all the way down to the base. So, AL is also the height of triangle ABC. So, we can see that when the base changes, the height changes as well, but we will get the same answer for the area of the triangle in each case because it is the same triangle ABC. Let's look at another example. We have a slanted triangle ABC with base AB and height EA. ABDE is a related rectangle of triangle ABC. We can move the height so that it starts from C, which is the vertex away from the base AB, and goes all the way down to the base. So, CF is also the height of triangle ABC. The area of the triangle is still equal to half times base times height. So, 
the area of triangle ABC is 6 square centimeters. Notice again that the base is one side of the triangle. What happens to the height if we choose another side of the triangle as the base? Let's find out. We have our triangle ABC from just now. Just like the previous example, we consider the three possible choices for the base of triangle ABC. We have already seen the first case. Let's look at the second case. Here, AC is the base. We can draw the related rectangle from the base like this. The base AC is the common side shared by the triangle and the related rectangle. In this case, the height is GA. It is perpendicular to the base. We can move the height so that it starts from B, which is the vertex away from the base AC, and goes all the way down to the base. So, BI is also the height of triangle ABC. Let's look at the third case. Here, BC is the base. We can draw the related rectangle from the base like this. The base BC is the common side shared by the triangle and the related rectangle. In this case, the height is JB. It is perpendicular to the base. We can move the height so that it starts from A, which is the vertex away from the base BC and goes all the way down to the line that is extended from the base. So, AL is also the height of triangle ABC. So, we can see that when the base changes, the height changes as well, but we will get the same answer for the area of the triangle in each case because it is the same triangle ABC. When answering questions on identifying the base or the height, look out for the right angle because the height must be perpendicular to the base. Try to draw the related rectangle to check. Now, go and try some questions on your own. Goodbye.